Hi, I'm Daniel. I'm a business owner and I give VoIP.ms five out of five. Click below to see my review. So before I went to VoIP.ms, I was using uh, the regular uh, phone systems and they were quite expensive, especially for the long distance calls. Then I heard about, you know, voice over IP things and I kept looking. A lot of them were quite complex. And then I found about uh, VoIP.ms and their explanation are so clear, so simple. The setup is simple. It's very, very cheap in terms of cost for the system, and it's super reliable, and that's what I was looking for. So I chose voice, uh, VoIP.ms because uh, they're super simple to set up, and their review were great in terms of stability, and that's what I was re really looking for. And um, in reality, they are super stable and reliable, so I'm really, really happy with that. Creating the account with VoIP.ms is super easy, super simple. The interface is quite straightforward. Uh, when it comes to set it up with your actual hardware, that's a bit more complex because uh, obviously all the hardware, hardware are different, uh, so, but, but they have a very, very comprehensive wiki. So you just need to look up what type of hardware you purchased to connect with their voice over IP ser uh, service. And then you just follow the step-by-step -step and set it up. And they even have uh, very, very neat tips for all the weird things that you can get like uh, at night uh, ring bells that are just fluke over the network and they tell you exactly how to fix that. So it was, was really great. So if you're looking for a great uh, voice over IP provider, I really, really recommend uh, using VoIP.ms. Uh, just make sure you do your research on the hardware side that you want to purchase because they don't sell hardware. So they, it's really a bring your own hardware company. So look up what how many ports you need, uh, what types of services you want to have over IP because they have all the services. They have the, the phone, they have the fax, they have the SMS over IP. So just look up the hardware that you really need. And for the rest, just create your account. It's super easy. And then once you have your account created, you have all the information that you just simply configure into your hardware and that's it. You plug your device and you're done.